Welcome to ESCP's Fish of the Month. I'd like to uh, introduce Philip Tozer, who is the colorectal consultant and lead for fistula surgery at the Robin Phillips Fistula Research Unit at St Mark's Hospital. Hello and welcome to ESCP Fistula Month. My name's Phil Tozer, I'm from St Mark's Hospital. And I just want to say a few words to you about fistula rationalization, one of the most important and useful techniques and tools in the fistula surgeon's arsenal. It's a very useful uh, concept, particularly for managing fistulae with a palliative loose seat on to reduce symptoms of discharge and pain and the risk of abscess by creating a more simple fistula. But the main use of rationalization is to take a fistula which is not amenable to treatment with a sphincter preserving procedure such as lift or plug or vaft and turning it into one which is. The two most common types of rationalization are laying open of intersphincteric or supralevator tracts into the anal canal or rectum which produces some risk of difficulty with continence and control and that has to be carefully assessed and balanced. There'll be more information about that in the talk on laying open. The other area which is simpler is to lay open tracts outside the external anal sphincter in the issue anal fossa. This can sometimes be relatively modest, for example, shortening the tract outside the external sphincter or combining two external openings. Or it can be very large with an incision running from three o'clock right round to nine o'clock posteriorly behind the anal canal in the case of an extra sphincteric horseshoe with a transphincteric tract running into the anal canal at six o'clock. These wounds can be high and deep and wide and require a lot of investment from the patient as well as the surgeon. Some surgeons favor packing these wounds to prevent early bridging and encourage healing by secondary intention. We don't use packing and instead encourage wide drainage, careful wound shaping, marsupialization and post-operative digitation to try and keep the wound open and encourage it to heal in the way that we want. Rationalization allows the surgeon to improve the fistula either in terms of symptoms or in terms of morphology, allowing a sphincter preserving procedure to take place. Thanks very much. I hope you enjoy the rest of ESCP Fistula Month.